Hey guys, this is East Order Eastern Cat in the Dow. Welcome back to your stage prescription Book of Memory Swaying Scale. So we are here in the top of the courthouse now. Uh, we managed to open all the doors as far as I can tell, apart from the door below us, I think, which is the main courtroom door. And probably a couple of things leading to the mines, but here we are on top of the courtroom, probably overseeing the trial that's being held. By I think the guilty guy should be this guy, right? I to be honest, I haven't been to a courtroom very often. I don't watch the news or anything that requires courtroom, so maybe a few screenshots of Phoenix Wright. But anyways, we are on top and we're saying this is Let's look down on them. There's people down there. And why do I go down to like 10 frames whenever it scrolls the freaking camera? Somehow this seems to be our destination. Silence! Are we the people that make the noise? We will now deliver the sentence to the accused. The accused trespass on the premises of the grocer Busan on Vera Street. Furthermore, the accused stole money and groceries from within the store with the intent to flee. The aforementioned crimes were meticulously planned in advance. Where are they now? Is the person at the front of the room uh, she is father? Alright. I think I mentioned this before, but I did pop on their site and the boy who I was calling Akili, apparently his um, original name was supposed to be Ashilu, so I think that's like supposed to be some really rough as translation. So that's why I'm calling him Ashilu now. Well, he said he, he did say he was the judge, so probably. Hmm. Even so, where's the fun in listening to all this? Without stealing, there's no way he could survive, right? Like stealing bread from someone? Well. I was merely accepting my just reward as should be paid to me. That's a fine thing to say. There was an advanced payment for healing him. What did you say? Did the accused not hear me? You will perform 20 years of hard labor. That's 20 years? Are you dissatisfied with the verdict? Of course I am. I have a sick mother. She can't even move about help. I need money to buy the medicine that keeps her disease from getting worse. With all the time I spend on caring for her, I cannot support us. You have already told us this. Under those circumstances, there must be something else that can be done. I didn't cause anyone harm, but it didn't seem as if I had any other choice then. We empathize with the accused family's situation. Still, the law is absolute. While no humans were injured, the law itself was violated. While I'm not around, what will happen to my mother? Are you gonna do something for her? That's the job of the government. So basically push on to someone else. Please, at least decrease it by 10 years. That is all I have to say. Court as an adjourn. So basically these guys are douchebags who just follow the laws as, as though these rules are like super strict and their dicks will get cut off if um, they even like touch it. I probably just painted a horrible image in people's minds. For school fifth, to think he gets slammed in 20 years. Feels like he didn't have the slightest interest in listening to what the accused had to say. He did. He did. It's quite obvious. Well, in the interest of crime prevention, he probably served nicely as an example. Well, who cares about the laws or whatever of this town? Hmm? Elna? And she walked off. Elna? What happened? Alright, so those two walked off. Uh, losing frames as it scrolls around. Wonder what's up with those two. Oh, something's happening! It's just grayed out! This is... an interference. Be careful, I... She... Elna said she wants to try watching the trial. Oh look, the boy's here. At that time, I didn't understand what she was thinking when she said that. At any rate, I was happy that the laws and my father were protecting this town. If Elna felt that way as well, that's why I we went to see the trial together. The other's expression seemed down. As we watched, she seemed to be thinking about something. At that time, I didn't think anything of it other than that she was listening in earnest. Because you're like this little bitch who tries to follow the rules way too hard. I couldn't grasp what it was out of soul. Your memory... Oh! Okay. Seems like he's remembering little by little. Though what he said just now wasn't very clear. Isn't it more like he doesn't want it to be clear? He's subconsciously denying it. Still, he somehow also seems to be trying to remember it. That would be quite convenient for us. 
Since we're trying to help him clear things up, aren't we? Perhaps this book is connected to a deeper fa facet of his inner mind. If he's intentionally guiding us, then he's quite con conscientious. He seems to have this, his own set of rules, so we have no choice but to ask the shield himself. That's true. He was really proud of his father. Hmm. Alright, we went deeper. This is... Looks like a slums or something. Still in the town it seems. Seems like it. But this place is really dirty, eh? Oh, I think it suits you perfectly. What? Hey, what do you mean by that? Cats like these kind of back alley places, right? I told you I'm not a cat. Oh no. Oh no, what in the world happened? She's covered in some stuff. You didn't have to go through all the trouble of leaving me a note. You could have just rung the bell. On top of that, calling me out to a place like this. Is she... Oh no? Those clothes, they're covered in blood? She I... That person, I... Yeah, basically she outed someone? Huh? My father, I killed him with my own hands. What did you say? That's a lie, right? I don't know, you couldn't. Hey, Shea, did you notice it? Huh? I always wear clothes with long sleeves. Do you know why? Because I'm covered in bruises. My body, my arms. All the wounds caused by that man. I don't want anyone to see. Anyone. Especially not you. Oh, uh, something really dark all of a sudden. That man, all he did was drink at home every day. And every day he hit me. He hit me even though there's no particular reason. For that man, just being there was likely reason enough. That's something like that is something like that happened. You had no idea, did you? That only the outward appearance of that man was good. Why? Why didn't you tell me? He had told me. If I had told you, what would you have done? Would you have killed that man in my place? There's no way I could have told you. That man said so. Even if you go blabbing to others, no, not one of them will believe you. That's right, I'm sure he was right. Because that man was a judge. That's... Lately, it's been really terrible. And this morning, that man picked up a knife. I've always thought this day would come. I feverishly tried to fight him off. Of course I did. I thought I was going to be killed. When I came to my senses, knife had pierced that man's chest. That man surely he thought... They all thought he would, could die. Ah. Elna. Hey, are you there? Hey, soldiers! No, it doesn't seem like she's here. Crap, where did she go? Even so, killing one's own parent, what a devilish axe. That devil is still wandering around this town. Find her before there are any more victims. Well, that's a standard of like justice. The one they're looking for is definitely me. Hey, she, I have a request. A request? I want you to explain the circumstances to your father. Huh? There was no other way. Well, self-defense. Please help me. That's... I can't do that. Why not? No matter what the circumstances, we must uphold the law. This kid is really tight on this stuff. No one can have a special privilege to circumvent the law. The law is to protect everyone, right? So protect me. Sorry, there's nothing I can do. You... You're just the same. Huh? The other day when we watched the trial, I thought so. They weren't seeing that person, seeing how he felt at all. There was no judgement. It was just someone blindly following the law. That's exactly what happened. Like, are you... Even like the short segment of the um, trial that we actually got to like watch, that's literally what happened. Um, why should someone like me, about to be killed, have done? Someone should I have just have died right then and there? Is it wrong to defend oneself? Hey, answer me, Shio. That's... Ah... Uh, Murdering one's own parent is a serious crime. There's no way I can avoid execution. If you won't do anything for me, then I'm going. Going? Where? I'll escape somehow and get away from this town. There's no other way for me to live. That's ridiculous. Don't stop me. At least let me go. Please. Oh no. You're the one who said the laws protect us all. That's wrong. The laws were only made to protect everyone but the weak. Over here. Alright. She's probably had to go. Goodbye. Elna runs off and soldiers are like running after her. No doubt about that. Hurry after her. Gah. And so he's after her too. Somehow this seems to be related to that Elna girl. Seems that way. 
Even so, that kid isn't very honest, jeez. Hey, your face looks like you're deep in thought. I am deep in thought. Why are you making a face like that such a big surprise? Because I wasn't expected. Gah, you little... <laughs> anyway, let's go after them. That's probably for the best. Alright, so we're going after them as well. And suddenly we're in front of the courthouse again. That's magical. What is this? There's so much noise all of a sudden. Looks like everyone's gathered at the courthouse. Uh, excuse me. Yes. What in the world is all this commotion for? What? You ask? Why? Why she had to protest, of course. To protest? Some time ago, you know, there was that girl who was abused by a judge. There was an incident where the, that girl turned the tables and murdered that man. Huh. Yes, that's right. Some time ago, the entire must have moved ahead a bit from the last event. In the end, they executed that girl, right? Okay! Was she? That child, she desperately begged to be spared at the trial. There was hardly a sympathetic ear for her at the courthouse. We've had our doubts about how things are done in the courts, but this is unforgivable. The people gathered here all be at the same dissatisfaction with the courts. I see. Thank you for explaining it to me. Oh dear. Guess that's how things are right now. What? You look like you had something to say. It feels like a normal situation. But even I'm surprised at how quickly they made an example of her. Well, at least I was more polite than I usually am. Hey. Hey, why are you so freaked out? Jeez, how rude. That girl, Eleanor, seems like in the end she could run away after all. Wonder how she had felt. <laughs> Either way, he could do anything for her. If he had made a clumsy attempt at helping her gotten the short end of the stick, that would have been even more foolish. Does he seem like the type who could deviate such a way? In the end, these humans can't think of anyone but themselves. Children, adults, it has nothing to do with their outward appearance. It's something you should understand very well. There's contrary to Emma. Why, thank you. We should try to get a little more detailed information from the people around here. Alright, sir! I was working in the mines under the courthouse. The treatment we received there was awful. We even staged our own demonstration, but they paid us no mind. So we've all been unable to suppress our anger for a while, but this incident is truly unforgivable. We gave up on the previous demonstration, but this time will be different. We'll fight until we force the huge judge out. So basically there's a riot. That girl's heartbreaking cries. Did the judge hear nothing when he heard them? If he didn't, then he's surely not human. To say nothing of being able to hand down such a judgement. How could he? Why that judge right away? We won't allow him to hand out such a judgement to a poor little girl. I, but I missed one, hold up, let me just redo that. Uh, oh my god, it's just spat out. I always thought the court's judgments were over the top though. This judgement was favouring one of the judge's own. To be sure, patricide is a serious crime. But hearing that girl's appeals, my heart truly ached. No parent should be allowed to get away with abuse. This may be imprudent to say, but I felt that she, the victim got what they deserved. Everyone present should have felt the same way. Naturally expected the punishment to be light? No, it should have been that way. Have the head judge handed out a cold sentencing. Why? I'm sure it's because the victim was also one of the judges. This is an abuse of power by the courts. Seeing that verdict, I felt truly terrified. If the court is allowed to keep going like this, I might be executed myself someday. The judgment up to now have concerned me, but I've turned a blind eye to them. I thought it was what you could call someone else's problem, but it's different now. This kind of incident could happen to anyone. It's unrelated to one's own will. That girl was merely unlucky. That's all. Even so she got executed. The way the courts are handling things now, that's why we had to change it. But a tragedy like this is never repeated. Alright, so basically, the judge is a, bit, a bunch of bricks. That's how it worked out. How many times people seem upset about what happened with Eleanor? Well, how do we go about searching? The law is supposed to be right. Oh look, he's back. No one should be able to change all of this. Yet, yeah, what I did. Did I abandon my friend? Did I abandon Eleanor? I... And he's floating away. Ah jeez. You just say what you want, then quickly run off somewhere. You know, she probably still trusts us in the law. And he wants to believe? We're going after him. Alright, we're going after him. Uh, okay. He's just gonna ghost his way into here and disappear, and... We're gonna walk into here slowly. Alright. 
So, he's gone. Well, what building is this one? Don't know. It's pretty big compared to the other buildings. Don't know. They seem to be crowds coming and going through the entrance. Don't know. Hey, give us some thought. That's your job, right? You know what a bit of cooperation would be? Hey, get out of here! That's the head judge's home, basically. We won't forgive you what happened in the courthouse. We demand you revoke that judge's cred credentials. That's right. That's right! Get out of here, judge! Basically, just watch people rising. Hey, judges. That boy's father, right? Okay, this is... Shiro's house? Bam, he's got a big house. Hmm. He lives in quite a fine house, eh? It's a sta state mansion. What else was he hiding besides that bridge? Is that what we're worried about? I'll be sure to leave me additional charges later on. That doesn't matter right now. What do you plan to do? Well, if we were lit here, then there's nothing to do but go inside, right? Seems troublesome to enter through the front. I've already long since given up on going in through the front. Oh, either way, um, <laughs> I thought I was actually like getting across the end, but obviously not. A lot of crowd of people are gathering at the gates. They're all really mad, aren't they? Alright, so we can do this, apparently. Okay, you should be able to pass through this hole. So go for it. Making me do manual labor again, eh? Guess I can't be helped. Alright, we've got the cat this time. So we need to somehow get, um... Uh, let's see, into here, so... What's this? We don't know, but there's a grappling hook. Is this grappling hook? Hooks. Can we climb the tree at all? It doesn't seem like it will reach from here. Uh, so what, you can't climb the tree? Come on, cat! Or was this to do? Nothing, okay. Uh, where else can we, can we go other places? Seems like we can climb up from here. And then what? Can we get up the tree from here? And we got rope. And can we get a little bit further along? Uh, we're, that's the spot over Alright, so we've got this now. Um, I think we can take this back over and give it to our reset, right? Try and see if this works. Wait, is that back to her? Yep. Yeah. Alright. Wait, I, I saw that. Okay, we're just gonna casually climb over this fence. What is this? Wonder what that is. The guy has a group as if something could fit inside. But I think we need to um get that thing up there. Wait, could I click on the tree before? Wait, can she climb this? No? Um, we need to get on... We need to get up here though. Doesn't seem... Wait, what? Doesn't seem like a lady such as myself could make it through from here. You can't get on top of the tree, so that doesn't help. Um, can you, like, can you not climb this? Alright, so you can't climb this, and he can't climb this now either. So I'm actually kind of stuck now. Whoopie do! What the hell am I doing here? Huh? And this is as far out of the tree as I can walk, right? Like. 
like just like kind of tiptoeing across here. Can you climb the tree? Well, there's always that option. We can kick it. Do we now have a valve handle? I wonder if this will lead to the basement. Perhaps we can get inside the house from here. Hey, are you listening? Hey, see? What is it? Just listen for a moment? Which is why I said what? Can you see the bottom? I can't. There's no guarantee it'll actually get in the house, is there? No guarantee. That's just it. Huh? That's just it. Are you scared? No, no way. Really? Really? I'm just talking about the risks. Okay, okay. Hey, what? Ready, sit, in he goes! It doesn't seem that far down, and so we just jump in. One hole, one animal, and one human, one animal, one hole. And we're in the basement, apparently. Oof. He's dead as hell. Phew. And, huh? We're out in the basement. This is more like, get out here, judge! So we went through the ground and ended up in the attic. I think. Those people from earlier are below. This place is like an attic or something. Hey, got it! This space is as twisted as can be. Ugh. Huh? What in the world am I? Looks like you're awake. What is this place? What happened to be? This is a shield's house. It's the attic though. Attic? But what? But earlier it felt like we were falling. Listen, a falling earlier and where we are now aren't important. They aren't? At any rate, we should be happy we were able to get inside. That memory from earlier was pretty vague. And for some reason, my head hurts. It probably does. Well, a lot of things happened. A lot? Yeah, it's too difficult to explain in words. Anyway, let's investigate inside. Okay, so he just accepts it now. Alright, so I think this might be a good place to um end off today. I actually thought we were getting close to the end last time, but apparently not. There's still a decent bit of this game to go, I guess. But um, anyway, that'll be it for Exit's prescription. But this time, if you want to follow along, remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Until next time.